Breaking news, Brazilian soccer legend Pele has died at age 82 after a year-long fight against cancer. Just last week, Pele's loved ones rushed to his bedside in Brazil as his condition appeared to worsen. NBC's Sam Brock has a look back at his life and legacy. It's called the beautiful game, the name bestowed on soccer by its greatest player, Pele, a man who made the impossible look effortless. Born into poverty in Sao Paulo, Brazil in 1940, Edson Arantes do Nascimento dominated the schoolyard where he picked up the nickname Pele. In 1950, he watched his father cry after Brazil's World Cup loss to Uruguay. Then I told him, Father, no, don't worry, I'm going to win one World Cup for you. Pele made good on that promise. In 1958, at just 17, he burst onto the world stage, becoming the youngest player to score a goal in a FIFA World Cup match. Brazil went on to claim the cup, the country's first ever, and later two more with Pele as their star, making him the only player to win three World Cup titles in the sport's history. The major European football clubs tried recruiting him, but Pele, also nicknamed the King by commentators, stayed loyal 19 years with his Brazilian team, Santos. Pele also became the world's most highly paid athlete, recognized everywhere. Few Americans at the time knew any professional soccer players, thrilled when he signed with the New York Cosmos in 1975 before finally calling it quits. You know, I feel very, very, very sorry because I love soccer. And uh, it's uh, like a uh, part of my life I, I lost. Off the field, Pele grew into one of the most well-known celebrities on the planet. A pitch man. Eu sempre levo comigo o cartão da America Express. A frequent White House guest. His life story on the big screen. And a role in Escape to Victory with Sylvester Stallone and Michael Caine. I had to give me ball. Here I do this, 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 go. The artist Andy Warhol famously quipped, everyone will be world famous for 15 minutes, but after meeting and painting Pele, he revised his statement, Pele will have 15 centuries of fame. I love the people, the people love me. In his later years, he served as a UN ambassador and a champion of both the poor and the environment but always remained beloved as simply Pele, the greatest soccer player ever. Sam Brock, NBC News. Our hearts are with the family of Pele as they are now mourning the loss of him. Um, and our thanks, of course, to Sam Brock for that report.